The real reason Jason Orange quit take that finally revealed. The real reason Jason Orange quit take that finally revealed the group's former manager has lifted the lid on Jason's unexpected decision. When Jason Orange left take that in September 2014, he left the entertainment world baffled. Making the shock announcement, he simply said, there have been no fallings out, only a decision on my part that I no longer wish to do this. Shortly afterwards, the speculation began. There were rumors that Jason's decision to go was related to a tax controversy surrounding the other three, Gary Barlow, Howard Donald and Mark Owen, a claim they vehemently denied. And Howard added that he believed Jason quit the band because he is no longer in love with the music, or recording it, or the whole process of it. Others speculated that Jason was longing for a more normal life outside of the limelight. Now, Nigel Martin Smith, who used to manage Take That, has revealed that Jason's decision to leave the band was neither related to a desire for more privacy nor was it down to the star suddenly falling out of love with music. The band manager said Jason hadn't felt confident enough about his own musical abilities and blamed Nigel for ruining his life. When I put Jason in the band he loved it but he turned around years later and said he was upset with me, he told the Daily Star. He said he couldn't sing, he wasn't a musician and I had no right to put him in the band. He wanted to know why I did it to him. He said he had loads of issues as a result of it and seemed to blame me for ruining his life. I couldn't believe it. I said. J, you've traveled the world first class, stayed in five-star hotels, had women throwing themselves at you, had the most amazing life, with how many millions in the bank? That's how bizarre it is. The trio that's left after Jason and Robbie Williams' departure have now vowed to finally crack America. After James Corden invited them onto his TV smash hit The Late, Late Show, rumors were rife that the trio were planning an assault on the Billboard charts. But they are in actual fact aiming for Broadway. Following the success of Gary Barlow's Finding Neverland, he confirmed there are definitely plans to take their musical, The Band, to the New York stage after its complete its UK run. The show incorporates Take That songs into a tale about fans of a pop group.